Hello and welcome to another SE tip of the week. So did you know that if you use Ready API to test your APIs and you have a Swagger Hub account, you can use the Ready API Swagger Hub integration to import API definitions from Swagger Hub to be used to create your functional tests within Ready API. And it's very easy to do it. So once you have a project in your Ready API workspace, you go over here to your API options and import an API definition. And this window will open on the Swagger Hub tab. First, you're gonna see your public API. So these are any public APIs on Swagger Hub. You don't need to log in to import these. If you go to my API, you'll have the option to log into Swagger Hub and you can log into either SaaS or on-prem. And all you need to do is specify your username and then your API key. And you don't even have to do it manually. You can click on the Get API Key button here. That's going to open Swagger Hub in a new browser window. If you're logged in, and you can copy that API key, paste it in here, and you're connected. And that means that you can now see all of your personal Swagger Hub accounts APIs. You can search for them. You can see the version number of the API. You can see the version number of the open API spec being used. Last time it was updated. And if you select an API and click on import, you will now have underneath your APIs section in your project, all of the operations, methods, and resource paths described in that definition. And you can start using those requests to create some functional tests and keep your tests in line with your API's design. So thanks for joining us for another SE Tip of the Week, and we will see you next time.